finding the rate of bacteria multiplication using a geometric progression. Now I'm sure most of you would have had curd at some point or the other in your life, right? Now we all know that the curd is basically made when you add to the milk, we add a bacteria. These bacteria keep on multiplying themselves, okay? And once they reach a particular level, then basically the entire milk is converted into curd, right? So let's say for example, and I'm taking these hypothetical numbers, these are not any kind of a benchmark as to actual scientific numbers which are applicable to convert milk into curd, right? So let's say you were told that there were 500 bacteria introduced in a bowl of milk. The bacteria grow at the rate of 40% every hour. If 3765 bacteria are required to make curd, how many hours will it take? Now, it's an interesting question, okay? So you were told that the number of bacteria which were added to the curd are 500 at the start of the process, okay? When the time increased from 0 to 1, these bacteria which were 500 originally are reproducing at the rate of 40% every hour. So at 0 hour, if they were 500, in R number 1, how much will they be? They will be 500 into 140% or simply putting in 500 into 1.4 right? So we can write that at the end of the one hour, we are told that the number of bacteria will be 500 into 1.4. Similarly, at the end of second hour, we'll have how many? 500 into 1.4 into 1.4, right? Why? Because these bacteria which are available at one hour end will reproduce themselves at the rate of 1.4 or 140%. Similarly for 3, 4, 5, 6 and so on. They'll keep on doing this and then again. But what you are told is that you require 3765 bacteria, okay, to convert the curd or to convert, sorry, the milk into curd. Okay. So basically you need to find out at which hour will this happen. Will it happen at the third hour, fourth hour, fifth hour, or sixth hour? Right? Now, if you notice, what is happening here is that at the end of R1, what do we have? We have 500 into 1.4 to the power 1. At the end of second hour, you have 500 into 1.4 into 1.4, or 500 into 1.4 to the power 2. Right? So basically, you need to find out what will be the value or the power of 4, let's call it as n, at the end of which the value of this number is going to be 3765. Right? So at the end of nth r, what is the value of n at which the number will be 3765 for the bacteria? So we know that 1.4 to the power n can be written as 3765 divided by 500, right? 
or simply you can write this as again I'll need the calculator for this so let me take the help from that 3765 divided by 500 is equal to 7.53 okay now you can also write 7.53 as 1.4 to the power 6 approximately which will give you the value of n is equal to 6 so at the end of 6th hour this milk is going to turn into curd okay we hope you would have liked this video Looking forward to seeing you in many more videos. This video is provided to you by iadiobook.com which has more than 1500 lead videos which are going and are free to everyone who wants to learn. Thank you for being with us today. Have a happy day.